Husqvarna, zero turns, lawn tractors, walk behinds, handhelds, and auto mowers. All at Hometown Motors Incorporated. Buy it here, get it serviced here. Hometown Motors Incorporated, 818 Eastern Avenue, Chillicothe. Talking with Zane Trace coach Heath Hinton, 56 to nothing over Clark Montessori. And coach, you racked up 400 plus yards tonight. You held them to 112 total, and um, that was it. Uh, and, and, and that's just an outstanding performance going into the playoff. Yeah, you know what? They uh, they, 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 did, they did some good things on it. They threw the ball well. Uh, Wire she would make some plays. Quarterback threw it up. And uh, we were a little worried about their speed and their size up front. And they were our kids handled it pretty well. So we, uh, you know, we get to play another another week. We get to go go back and improve. And um, like I told like I told the radio, man, our our young kids really proud of them. Those guys sticking in there and hanging out. And we, we get it. We get them out of practice a little earlier now. But they're 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 the heart of uh, of our scout teams. And they're still they're still working really hard for us. And then you know our seniors are doing a great job leading our captain, doing a great job job leading on us. You know, uh, talking to Daniel Barnhart here a while ago, a kid that does it on both sides of the ball and. You know, you don't have the luxury to be a, a one-way team in that regard, but you got some studs that can can do it on both sides of the ball. Sure. You know, I thought, you know, our, uh, we got different guys to step up every week. So, um, you know, whether it be tight ends like it was today or running backs out of the backfield catching the ball or, you know, off of the line is steady. Um, now we got to improve some improve some stuff, got some leakage up there. But, you know, they played a lot of guys in the box. We knew they were going to get us on a couple of plays. I thought Carter did a good job stepping up the pocket sometimes. Uh, missed on a couple of throws, but we got to get a little bit better at that. But um, there's some great things that come, come for us. We're not done playing. Keith, lastly, this is something your uncle talked to me many, many years ago when they were used to going deep into the playoffs mm -hmm. about pacing the team throughout – maybe mid-season on yeah is that a lesson that you've picked up on well you know he's with me so he tells me what to do most of the time so he uh <laughs> now he's a smart 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 guy and he uh he's been through the process so why not listen to him and a lot of our coach staff's been through that process with him or and now been with me too so i uh, got a lot of veteran guys got a lot of guys can't walk up that hill now any, anymore but they're uh, there are a lot of great guys but yeah we start we start cutting down uh, our practice time make sure it's fast and efficient and our kids are getting a lot of um the individual reps are also getting their footwork, their fundamentals in, and, and we keep doing that every each and every week. Ethan, Zane Trace, 56 to nothing over Clark Montessori, heading to week 12 next week. Ethan, congratulations. Thank you. Appreciate you.